Joe Piatau here with your MSM Sports Shot. This episode is being brought to you by Full Disclosure Nutrition NY.com. Wow, even on Veterans Day, there was a handful of NFL players taking a knee during the national anthem when the majority of them said basically like a kind of a like almost like like a like a like a truce, kind of like what, what the, um, the uh, during the Tet holiday in 1968 in Vietnam was supposed to be. And then the VC did not hold up their end of the bargain, and neither did their brethren, the NVA. But I digress. The um, I guess in this case, appropriately enough, the NVA slash VC are some of the NFL players who decided to take a knee, even though it was Veterans Day weekend, and they said that they were not going to do so. That is the most inappropriate of actions that you could do. And to me, you know what? That makes it, it's not just anti-police. That makes it that it is anti-military, anti-flag, anti-country, anti-establishment, anti-authority. It's not just uh, uh, racial injustice in the criminal justice system. Stop, that's a bunch of fucking bullshit to begin with. But that's not the point of this video. The point of this video is proud dad moment times two, okay? Because the NFL players are doing such most fucked up things as far as it goes to the flags, it makes other levels of football want to do even more when it comes to honoring the flag, the police, the military, etc. My son's high school varsity team, we played in the uh, county semifinals, a home game this week. And before they get, they, they sent the emails out and they said, everybody get there early because we're going to be uh, with the flags and all of that. And we want the stands full for this. It's going to be pregame ceremony. So we all got there early, cold day, don't matter. It's fucking football. Sat in the stands. The team captains came out and walked. They have a track around the high school field. I'm sure most of you have it, the same situation at your schools. And our captains came out with all different flags of the different branches of the service, plus the police flag. That's the American flag that has a blue line. It's like all white, and it looks like American flag, but it has a blue line in the middle. And I had posted that on Instagram, which was the cover of a high school yearbook also. Uh, varsity football yearbook, not the school yearbook. But you you know what I mean. So those kids came out with those flags. But then coming out of the locker room, which is far off in our field. I mean, you're in the stands. You have to look all the way past the goalpost. And then there's a building there. And the team came out all holding full-size American flags. And not just some cheap dollar store shit flags. Real metal poles with the like the silver eagle on the top of them. Every player on our team, now we have 46, I think, kids on the team. Even the injured kids had the flag. My son was had crutches and a, a shibuti, I call it, the shibuti. And I'm going to show the video and you can see it. He had the flag with the crutches. And then they all lined up on the goal line. And during the, the, the school band played the national anthem. And then all the players ran towards uh, midfield with the flags. But obviously my kid Jimmy couldn't run because he's in crutches. <laughs> so he's hobbling with the flag, holding the pole, doing his fucking duty. And uh, one of the assistant coaches came up and, and took the flag from him. So it was easier for him to get to the sideline. So that just goes to show you Michael Bennett's of the world, Eric Reed's of the world, Marshawn Lynch's of the fucking world. You are not football, okay? There are many levels of football that are still interesting to the people boycotting your shit fucking league. That means you also, Roger Goodell, okay? $50 million in the fucking uh, private jet and shit. If that's true, you, you're fucking more delusional than fucking Charlie Sheen was when he said winning, okay? People are going to watch high school football. People are going to watch college football. People are going to watch arena football before they watch the NFL again. Because people are pissed off and you fuckheads are losing money week after week after week. I am so proud of these high school kids carrying those flags. I posted that fucking video everywhere. Because that is what it's all about. Not these fucking pieces of shit taking a fucking knee. And you will see in the next issue, this is the summer... 
fall issue of Muscle Sport Mag. We delve into this topic. Yeah. We don't pull back. We don't fucking hold back. We let it all fly. Go to musclesportmag.com slash subscribe. Then you will get that fall issue as soon as it's hot off the press before it's out for the general public. We'll see you guys on the next episode.